<laughs> oh, it's a beautiful day, Wormy. It sure is, Hermy. It's probably one of the nicest days I've ever seen. You said it, Hermy. Ah! I'd have to say, of all the days I've ever seen, this one ranks about a... Uh, wormy. Wormy! Help, Hermy! Help me! Wormy! How'd you get in that mud puddle? But th that's very dangerous, you know. Mud puddles are hazardous to your health. Yeah, I know. Just, just get me out. I'll get help. Uh, don't go anywhere. That's the problem. I can't go anywhere. What happened to you? I fell into a mud puddle. I'm sinking. I remember when I fell into a mud puddle. Seems like just yesterday. We were under heavy attack. The enemy was all around. Bombs were exploding to the left, to the right. Run, I cried. As I did, I fell into a mud puddle. I was there for three days. Three long, hard days. I tried everything to get out. But it was no use. I had to eat the mud to survive. Eventually, a squad came by and pulled me out. I was never the same after that day. Never the same. Never the same. Hey, boy, wait a minute, what about? Oh, never mind. Oh, oh good, you're still here. Well, of course I am. I brought a towel to clean you up when you get out. I don't need a towel. I need to get out. No towel? Hmm. Some bugs are so ungrateful. Okay. Um, don't move. I'll be right back. Army! Uh. Well, well, well. I hope you've learned your lesson. What? Falling into mud puddles. What kind of bug does such a thing? You should know better. But I... Uh... Messing up the garden with your ugly mud. I have a mind to take this up with the insect council. Good idea, Iggy. Let's file a petition. Better yet, an injunction. What's that? I have no idea. <laughs> I just don't get it. Hey, Wormy. Good news. I found some perfume to help you smell better when you get out. Lilac. I don't need to smell better when I get out. I need to get out. You know, uh, you should take better care of yourself. You know, a little deodorant wouldn't hurt. Think about the rest of us for once. I can't believe this. <laughs> <laughs> no! How could this happen? You've fallen into a mud puddle. Yes, yes. At least somebody sees the seriousness of this situation. Perfectly good caterpillars like you shouldn't fall into mud puddles. Oh, why do bad things happen to good caterpillars? Oh, wormy. I'll go pray for you. Bye. Thanks for your prayers, Freddy, but I, I need... Uh, 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 oh. Worry? I know it's been difficult, so I'm going to write your memoirs about your time in the mud puddles. Let's start at the beginning. Tell me about your childhood. I don't need to write my memoirs. I don't need stories about the time someone spent in a mud puddle. I don't need a towel or perfume when I get out of the mud puddle. I don't need people telling me how bad I am for falling into a mud puddle. I don't need someone crying that I fell into a mud puddle. I need help getting out of the mud puddle. Well, why didn't you just say so? You see, Hermie, Proverbs 18.24 says, a real friend will be more loyal than a brother. What I really needed was someone to reach out and help me with my situation. You're right. 
That was well said. I'll remember that next time. Now let's finish our walk. Oh, uh, oh, a little help. Wormy, why are you smiling like that? Uh, uh, okay, okay, I've learned my lesson. Uh, you're going to get a stick, right? <laughs> Wormy? Wormy? Have you ever known someone who's hard to get along with? You know the type. There's just something about him or her that makes being a friend a little difficult. <laughs> it could be any number of things. The way they act, the way they talk. Or the way they chew their food with their mouth open. Hermie, I didn't see you there. Yeah, I don't like open mouth chewers either. Or th the ones that talk during movies. Definitely. Or they uh, pick their nose in public. Ooh, that's not good. Or the ones that write all these books telling you how to live your life. Yeah. Hey! Oh, 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 the ones who always say, hey, Wormy, I have an idea, and it always falls apart because it causes more problems than when it started. Uh, Hermie, that's you. It is. You're right. Yeah. Well, well, I take that back. I like those guys. As you can see, sometimes God puts people into our lives to challenge us. One bug is about to enter our garden who's a little hard to get along with. Not because he's mean or chews his food with his mouth open, but because he stinks. Gather around. Camp Bugaboo is about to officially open. Let's make sure everyone has their assigned duty. Lucy, you're doing campfire stories. Antonio, games and sports. Lizzie, you're our camp cook. Hermie, you're doing, uh, what are you doing? Ah, very good question. I, um, am uh, uh, um, in charge of something. Uh, uh, hey! I'm in charge of the uh, whistle. <laughs> Technically, the term is executive in charge of whistle relations. <laughs> but uh, hey, I'm, I'm not one for titles. Okay, everyone's here except Skeeter. Where's Skeeter? <laughs> Skeeter, report for duty, sir. What's Skeeter's job? He's driving our school bus. Oh. You got to be kidding. That's about as ridiculous as putting me in charge of the whistle. You are in charge of the whistle. Well, who came up with that idea? Skeeter, we are ready for you to go pick up the campers. I am on my way! <laughs> now who put a tree here? Hang on, kids! Oh, there's a close one! <laughs> Bye! <laughs> yeah! Hey, Riley! Yeah, 
<laughs> Hello. How are you? Glad to have you at camp. Hello. Wait a minute. One's missing. Stanley. I knew I forgot someone. <laughs> I'll get right to it. Got it! Got it! No problem! No, no problem. Well, the bus isn't coming. I guess I'm not going to camp. <laughs> no, I have to go. I promised my mom and dad. Oh, oh, it's going to be terrible. I just know it. God? Yes, Stanley? I don't feel so good. Tell me why. I, I, I don't want to go to camp. I, I feel so all alone. And you're afraid the others won't like you because... Because... Sometimes I stink. God, why did you make me so stinky? Stanley, I made you just the way you are. And I don't make mistakes. But I'm afraid to go to camp. What if the others don't like me? I will be with you. Just remember that. Okay, I will. Thanks, God. Oh, sorry, I'm late, kid. I mean, I got a little turned around in the direction. Hey, what happened here? Okay. Let's get this over with. Soldier, what happened? It was the smell, sir! I couldn't breathe! I, I did all I could! Smell? Uh, what smell? Hello, everyone. I'm Stanley. Hello, Stanley! Welcome to Camp Bugaboo! I'm... <coughs> joking! <laughs> How smell? I mean, how swell of you to come? I'm sorry about the... About the what? Oh, we're just uh, glad to smell you. Uh, see you. <laughs> we're, uh, we're going to have a great time. Right, every bug? Yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, uh -huh. yeah sure. sure. <laughs> yeah. Uh <-huh>. um, <clears throat> maybe I should go home. Uh, don't even stink. Uh, uh, think about it. Uh, come on, <laughs> let's uh, have some fun. <laughs> All right, time for some tug of war. Are the two sides ready? <laughs> On your mark, get set, go! Winner, <laughs> Stanley, medic! Well, 
take him. We'll take him. Hutch. Uh, Mr. Antonio, the teams are even. We don't have room for one more player. Yes, yes, they are. Hmm. Why don't you take a rest, sport? We'll get you in the next game. Oh, oh yeah, sure. I understand. I, I knew it. I knew this would happen. No one wants to be around me because I stink. Why did I ever come to camp? Flowers cower, leaves shake and shiver. Oh, as far as I can tell, this smell is far worse than 18 day old out in the hot sun flies buzzing around stinky old rotten chop liver. I think, I stink. I turn the green grass pink. Wherever I go, this smell follows. This cloud I make, no one can take, I think. I stink, so drop me in the drink. Please don't shriek because I reek, but me thinks me stinks. When I was a young bug, no bigger than a gnat, I learned to read and write and spell. Then one day I discovered, as I ran for cover, the thing that I was racing from was running from my own smell. Oh, I think. I stink, I turn the green grass pink Wherever I go, the smell follows This cloud I make, no one can take, I think I stink, so drop me in the drink Please don't shriek because I reek But me thinks me stinks Now that I'm much older and seen a lot of stuff It seems my group of friends have shrunk But it's hard to make friends when they're playing pretend Instead of hanging out with me, they'd rather go hang with skunks So oh, I think I stink, I turn the green grass pink Wherever I go, the smell follows This cloud I make, no one can take, I think I stink, so drop me in the drink Please don't shriek because I reek But me thinks me stinks, so oh, I stink, I know I'm sorry I've been trying He stinks, so drop him in the drink Oh, please don't shriek because I reek So sorry, I, I, but I don't smell it. <laughs> Ooh, what is that? Tofu and bean sprout salad, man, with stewed tomatoes and tater tots. Stanley is sitting all by himself. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Oh, I think so. Well, here goes. Hi, Stanley. Is anyone sitting here? No, no. Nobody. Great. Uh, mm. So, Stanley... What? Ugh. Sorry. I don't feel so good. Yeah, I think we're going to skip lunch. Hey, are you gonna eat those tots? This isn't good, Hermie. Hmm. Well, this sure stinks. Literally. The little fleas wandered deep into the swamp. That's when they heard the groans. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha! 
Their little flea knees shook. Deep in the mist, they could see it. The swamp gas monster. <gasps> ah! Uh, oh. Oh, I thought you were the swamp gas monster. The little fleas fled as fast as they could. When they suddenly got stuck in the mud, the swamp gas monster moved closer. God is with me. God is with me. Every step the monster took was closer to their doom. The fleas pulled and pulled, trying to free themselves. Finally, the fleas were free and they ran. Th th then what happened? The end. <sighs> what a terrible ending. <laughs> Who would be scared by that story? <laughs> Swamp gas. It's the monster. Run for your lives. <laughs> <laughs> Mm, gas is everywhere. Mm. Hold your breath. <laughs> ah, ah, what a great night's sleep. What a beautiful morning. Oh, man. I must even stink in my sleep. Cool! I, I want to try. Oh, wow. This is higher than I thought. This camp is fun, but Stanley sure is making it hard. Yeah, we like him and all, you know, for a stink bug, but he just stinks. Yeah, we gotta do something. You know what that means, Wormy? We have to pray. Hermy! I'm impressed you thought of that. You are learning. Yep, I know my stuff. <laughs> Let's see. Um, God, it's us. Hello, Hermy. Hello, Wormy. Uh, God, we have a problem. It's Stanley. Yes? What about him? Well, um, uh, how, how do we put this? He, um, oh, he, uh, uh he stinks. Uh, he doesn't stink like he's not good at something. He, uh, he stinks as in, uh, he smells bad. So, uh, can you fix him? Maybe he's not the one with the problem. What does he mean? I don't know. Uh, do you think he can smell me? <laughs> Come to think of it. Hey, I've been at camp for a couple of days. Why do you think he stinks? Hmm, poor hygiene? No. Stink bugs stink when they are afraid. Ooh. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah that of makes course, sense. that makes sense, yeah. That's it. I always get nervous and afraid, and then I stink. So what should I do? I have to face my fears so I won't be afraid. Now, what am I afraid of? Heights. I'm going to the top of that tree, and I'm not coming down until my stink goes away. God, that makes sense. He's not just afraid of camp or, or the high dive platform. He's afraid of what others might think about him. Hermie, 
Wormy, who made Stanley? Oh, I know the answer to this one. You. Do I make mistakes? No. Why do you think I made Stanley stink? Now that's a good one. We haven't figured that one out yet. Accept him and see what happens. But the stink and the smell and the, 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 the yuck. Just accept him as he is and be his friend, Hermie. His biggest fear is being rejected. Oh, wow. That's so sad. No wonder. I got just the idea. Come on. Oh, boy. Here we go again. This is a great idea, having a party for Stanley. To show him that we appreciate him and accept him. But, uh, did you remember to invite him? Oh, Haley and Bailey are out looking for him. They're telling him that it's lunchtime and we're gonna surprise him. Here they come, quiet. Surprise! Surprise! Oh. It's Stanley. He he tried to climb the tallest tree in the garden. And he can't get down. Uh, uh, oh, boy. I, I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid. Oh, I'm really afraid. Oh, boy. Oh, man! Oh, save him! Oh, oh, oh. Oh, a lot closer than I thought. Skeeter, take me up there. I have to talk to him. Uh, Stanley Stinkbug, this is Hermie. Remain calm. Why are you up here? I, I, I thought if I faced something that scared me, then I wouldn't stink. I, I heard you and Wormy talking to God, and it made sense. Stinkbugs stink when they're afraid. If I'm not afraid anymore, then, 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 then I, I won't stink. Yes, but are trees your biggest fear? No. Are tall trees your biggest fear? No. What is? Ugh. Other bugs not liking me. And why would they not like you? Because I stink. You're afraid that bugs won't like you because you stink. That fear causes you to stink, which causes other bugs to run away. Now, you think they don't like you, but they're really running away from the stink, which comes about because you're afraid bugs won't like you. I mean, that really stinks. It does, I think. We have a surprise waiting for you. We want to show you how much we like you. You like me? Even though I stink? Even though you stink, uh, uh, smell, uh, are, uh, nasally challenged, uh, anyway, come on. Okay. Somebody get him! Hold on! No, wait! Not us! <laughs> I... <laughs> I can't... I can't breathe! Skeeter, you saved Stanley. I did? 
I, I did. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> Who keeps moving this tree? This way, Stanley. It's time to eat. Surprise! Stanley, we wanted to do this to show you that we love you and we welcome you to this camp. We're very happy you're here. You are? I, you really want me around? Even with my stink? Well, God made you that way for uh, <clears throat> some reason. Even though you uh, have a certain... Aroma on the outside. On the inside, you have a good heart. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. I've never felt so comfortable before. Everyone always runs away before they get to know me. I'm glad I came to this camp. Hey, look! Stanley's smell is going away. Yes! It's going to be a great camp now. Hey, like I made this cake, you know? It's carrot cake, of course, with tofu and sprouts. So good. Just nasty. N A S T Y nasty. tube of toothpaste feels like. Oh, oh no! This is scary! Really, really scary! Sorry, guys. When I'm afraid, I start to stink. God made me that way. It's a good thing he did. And because of that, you protected all of us. You're right. It's a good thing God made me stinky. I guess God knew what he was doing. Right, everyone? Good job, soldier. Thank you for sending me to this camp. I, I've made so many nice friends. Friends are always there for you, Stanley. They love you no matter who you are, no matter what you've done. And no matter how much you stink. That's right. I, I, I gotta go. The big game's about to start and they want me to play. They even picked me first. Bye. Thank <laughs> you. 
43, 22, 81, hot! Stanley, imagine that the swamp gas monster is right behind you. Run, Stanley, run! <laughs> there has to be some kind of rule, rule about that. <laughs> Sorry, I checked. When we meet someone that's not like us, we have to remember that God made them that way, and He doesn't make mistakes. And instead of looking for ways to change them, we could look for ways to accept them and love them, even if they stink. Phew, what's that smell? Hey, Max, yeah, that was a great story about friendship. Do you smell that? Is Stanley with you? Uh, Oh, that's my Limburger cheese and my green tomato wrap. Want a bite? No thanks. Can you put that away? It really stinks. Max, I think you have a problem accepting stinky sandwiches. Yes, I do. Here, maybe this will help. Better? Now do you accept my sandwich for what it is? I guess so. Hey, how does it look? Oh! It's you, with a clothespin on your nose. Mm -hmm. Good sandwich. Very good sandwich. Let's sing a campfire song. Um, who has a request? Fancy Wincy Spider. We just did that one, Webster. Old MacDonald had an ant farm. We tried that, but ants don't make a noise. With a here and a there and a... What's the point? Where is Shaka? Eh, my French is a little rusty. Uh, how about honey, honey, bow bunny, banana, fanta, no funny? Oh. Farmer in the Dell. What's a Dell? Nobody knows what a Dell is. How about home in the garden?